Okay then, so we are going to be progressing through... I guess you might call this Central Krat itself. It says the lobby there, but... It seems a bit weird to call this the lobby walkthrough. We're setting off from the lobby. Uh, first things first. I highly recommend clearing out the square here. Or the open kind of markety area that we have. It's not a square, it's more of a circle, but still. Courtyard, I guess, we'll go with. There are quite a lot of enemies here. We're going to take some damage. There's a few things we can practice against in terms of, like, future enemies that we're going to have to face quite often. In particular on... Can we see it from here? You can see it. You can see the kind of gaseous, foggy-looking enemy over there. If you think Basilisk from Dark Souls, if you play played Dark Souls, that's exactly what that is. Um, almost to a T, literally, it, ha it, like, creates a fog. It does insta-death if the uh, status effects builds upon you, so just be careful. And we are uh, fighting that. I'm going to use Puppet String on you. Jokey boy. Um, get used to that concept. There are a couple of bosses that have the same thing where... When you uh, put them into a fatal state like that, they'll have like little follow-up attacks. And uh, Amy is just in general going to be trying to catch you out now. Mjolnir has been retrieved deal with you. Thank you for the thermite. Come here, biggin. I want you. I want you a lot. Got friends around here as well. I'll probably just aggro it. There we go. <laughs> probably shouldn't follow it that deeply into that area. This guy is, you know, pretty good source of Ergo right now, but not really the best for us, to be honest. I'll drop two in there, come on. Dropping 1300, pretty good actually. <laughs> All of the loot around here, so much of it. Leo. Doesn't normally attack like that. <laughs> Usually it tries to get you with the cloud. That one was decided it was going to be aggressive. Oh look, we finally had an enemy drop as a half moonstone, so we could actually say, yes, look, you do get them here. Pain in the ass to get them, they are. Uh, is that the full loop? I think it is. Now, my recommendation is, first, if you want a couple of levels, you can clear that out pretty comfortably, and you can definitely get at least one or two more levels out of it. Secondly, if you have used too much of your heals, or you want to go set something up, obviously you can go ahead and do that now, and then pass through the square without fighting everything again, and you'll be in a much fresher state. For smoothness, I'm going to continue going forward. If I have to go down, then so be it, and I'll just have to come back through. It's fine. Ooh. Excuse me. Biggin. Run here. Uh, this one is a one-off fight, so don't worry about it too much if it does hurt you. Pretty mean. It really bugs me that we can't dodge through the red attacks. Get off. You're down now, though. <laughs> Revenge! 
You're lucky we didn't have more puppet string. That's all I'm going to say. Get a new arm now if we want it. Dun, 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 dun. That's the path of progression. So we'll loop this way, naturally. Ooh, trying to grab me. Ooh, ooh. With the weird... They called, isn't that called like a pro, pros, prosbosis or something really weird? Ten Joe points if you get the answer to that, right? I don't know what it is. Um, ooh, look. We're in, like, the best place to farm. Here you go. This will be the apartment. It's probably a better place to uh, name this after. Abandoned apartment. Hmm. We'd go and spend that, but I think we're okay for now. I'd rather get a couple of levels in first. Hello, vendor. He's got a weapon. And I think he's actually got a thing to decode as well. Yeah, there's the weapon. He's got a caliber if you need it. And uh, these are obviously all very important for resistances. Get these when you're ready. I'm going to wait for a bit for now. Place is crazy. Um, this used to be the workshop's transportation base close to Krat Central Station. Yeah, so I know where I am. That's why the puppets were so hell bent on attacking the place during the fight. But I don't see it myself. These because they cause disruption. They also give you ergo, which is nice. So let's add that earthquake. Yeah, for these. The, the moveset's really annoying, in my opinion. Keep moving. <laughs> As with a lot of the enemies, as we start getting towards the end, they all have stupid amounts of tracking, stupid amounts of closure. They're just, in general, annoying to uh, to deal with. I've really read that. Lover's letter. Anyways, let's continue forward. So, uh, you should see... As we come around here, it's going to be a shortcut up just that way. It takes us a bit of time to get there, it's fine. We could go ahead and do it now. Ah. Um, by fighting past that, we could do that first. Butterfly appears kind of in that little bit of an area there. If you stood there, watch him wait for me, aren't you? with you first. Oh, didn't notice the disruption. This time, let's take out the uh, spire thing first. Shall we? And so we'll show this left hand side because for now it feels kind of disappointing Remember when I said we needed that frost sword well later on this is where we're going to bring it and clear, these area, clear this area out for now just so you guys can see what's over here oh man where you can run get off Clouds take too long to dissipate. In my humble opinion. <laughs> it's like still there. The thing's been gone for ages. Here we are. Another one. It's all free ergo, so we might as well take it. Excuse me. I don't need to go down again. That would be bad. Loot over here. Surprisingly, nothing to push us off. You know, that is the uh, kind of gullduggery that we are used to these days. That is the area mostly looted. So the NPC that you'll need is actually up these stairs. 
We don't have the um, the decryption yet. So this dude has not appeared. Eventually there'll be a merchant here and he wants us to show him a weapon. So we will have that sorted by the end of the series. All right, big boy over here. Why give us the whole he sat down thing if we're going to attack him? It's not an advantage. Now that, however, is an advantage. They do per hit. always, always crazy. We'll get a bit of loot down. I'm just going to uh, open the shortcut first. Now I don't have to aggro half the street for a shot put. I believe there's nothing in this corner over here. The path progression is just around that little corner we ran past a second ago. Just to double check. Yeah, nothing up here. Nothing there at all. I'm talking really softly now, and it's eh, my throat is dying on me. Ah, stop talking. Ah. Loot with disruption. Put spire. Come on, don't. This enemy. This enemy. What worked on it? I'm definitely going to go rest. Let's uh, s spend all of your ergo here. Don't fight this before you spend your ergo. Again, so burning through some of my consumable ergo items has put me on 50k. Should be nice to have three extra levels. Whatever. I actually need a little bit of extra capacity right now. So we're going to do that. Um, and that's because I switched to... That do it. Looks like it does. Yeah, so we're not on yellow there anymore. Good. Some of that. Some of that. Uh, that's because I switched to a better disruption cartridge. <laughs> so, do be better now, and then we can head on back over. Uh, yeah, band apartment. Let's go. Alright, so let's have a quick run back to where we were. I'd rather keep this run in, just so people can see. Quick route back, right? Otherwise, could be not very pleasant. Across the board, I'm just gonna get past all this. Don't know how far that thing will follow me. No, it looks not far. Okay, I almost forgot about this enemy. That's how terrible it is. <laughs> Blotted it out of my mind. The next mini boss is actually pretty fun, but this one. Mm -hmm. Questionable at best. This is probably going to kill me three times in front of you guys. I just thinking if I've got any good ideas with me. Let's have the shot put on, just in case we stagger it and want to stagger it quickly. Alright, so this thing inflicts disruption. It's like mini version of the previous boss, so... 
just bear with me. Get off. It's got silly move set. Copy arm though. Copy string should I say. Or the win. Can't get in for the crit. We got it first time then, that went pretty well. A little bit string for the win, what can I say? Although I think actually the update's been in now, so I guess it's a little bit easier. That was a real issue before. Make that out to be really hard, didn't I? Like, what have they done? <laughs> what have they done? Uh, collapsed workshop tower, yes. Uh, let me just have a look in here for a second. Is this where I think it is? Yeah, okay, cool. Let's go. This is pretty quick, actually. Whack that. Charged R2. For it. Uh, most of these enemies we are going to be pretty uh, intense on getting them down like that because they're a pain in the ass otherwise. There's room with two of them which is a bit more difficult to do it in. So same thing here look. Gosh, start two. Step off a bit. It's making me think we do need more technique after all. The damage difference is quite noticeable here. So this is where this is going to be much nastier because there's another one. Coming over that way. We've got to be quick about taking this one down. Otherwise we're going to get out of hand and you're real bad. Let's do that. Right, so with this guy, uh, he has good tracking on all of his attacks, but we should be able to get around the back. That is your best ergo farming route. They've almost done it on purpose, right? Even almost all of them are like back to us on the way in. Dun 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 dun. Uh, we need to jump off here because there is loot. It's pretty important to call what this is now, but it's important we need it. I think it's a supply box actually. This is how you can purchase uh, the big moonstones. Yes. Up the ladder! Alright then, so, to deal with this bit, we're gonna run around. I'm gonna run hit this guy, should put him down. Shouldn't have gone for the second hit there, I was not confident it was gonna one-shot him. We'll know that with this one. Back. Wrong thing. So we'll do this as the farming run. Are we close to the short? Yeah, we're close to the shortcut, I think. Should loop around to a ladder. Um, before the next mini boss, which will give its own video, I think. Because it does kind of work as a boss. And I see no reason not to do it. So it is. Where is it? Yeah, just there. That's the next boss. Cool. So we can finish this video right here then. That's all good. 
All you need to do is go down this way. That is going to... That's going to loop us back around. Should start a now. Okay, so just because I think it's going to be good for this channel and very good for this character. I'm going to do a quick loop of the farming run and I'm going to do it as a quick video. It's probably going to be like two minutes long. Um, and we'll call it Ergo Farming Method. Eliza P, something like this. Starting from the collapsed street area. So catch you guys again very shortly for that.